Hey everyone, Captain Owl here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys a super simple AFK chicken farm for your 1.17 or 1.16 worlds. Let's get right into it. So this design was originally produced by Solvoid, aka Sourceless. You can check out his channel down below. Please subscribe to him. He spends hours on making these farms, and I just showcase them on my channel. So you guys should definitely go subscribe. He is all the credit. The materials for this build are as such. You will need 64 stairs of any type, 8 pieces of glass, 8 pieces of stone, whatever type. You need 64 smooth stone slabs or any slabs. You will need your polished basalt or any wood type. Then you will need your 4 chests, 2 redstone repeaters, 6 hoppers, 2 pistons, 4 observers, 4 redstone dust, 2 levers, 2 rails, 4 dispensers, 3 or 2 oak buttons, two resident comparators, two iron trap doors, and two minecart with hoppers, and two lava buckets. First thing that you're going to do is you're going to have an outline like I do here with the cornerstones and the basalt and the smooth stone slabs on the bottom. This area is going to be six by six, so make sure you make an outline like I have here. The next thing that you can do is you have two choices. You can either have bulk storage right here, here where you can collect multiple eggs and multiple chickens at once or you can have a very minimal design one storage i like to choose the one storage since bulk storage is kind of i don't know it's just you get so much space for a lot of chests and this one just seems more simple next thing that you're going to do is you're going to grab your hoppers you're going to break these two blocks then you're going to put the hoppers into this chest then you're going to be putting your dispensers here and full solid blocks on the sides. Then grab your rails and place two rails down here and grab your minecart with hopper and place down your minecart with hoppers down here. Next, destroy the rails underneath so that the hopper falls onto the other, the minecart with hopper falls onto the hoppers. Then grab your pistons and make sure that they're facing downwards like this on both sides make sure that they're facing downwards otherwise this will not work then put slabs right above the hopper with minecarts and then grab a lever or a button doesn't really matter whichever works grab a lever two levers and just push the slab into the hopper this helps stabilize it in some way then grab your dispensers and place them down facing down like so and you can finally then block off the front with some nice glass. For the redstone bit, you're going to be putting two redstone comparators, turn them both on, and put two solid blocks behind it. Then at the back of the redstone comparators, you're going to be putting some redstone dust here and here. And then you're going to be putting redstone repeaters on the other side facing this way. And finally, connect the repeaters to the comparators, like so, and make sure that these are also solid blocks. Next, grab your pistons and make sure that they're facing up on top of here. Then grab your four observers and make sure that they're facing towards the pistons that are going up. Then fill in the back part with some full blocks of your choice. Next, you're going to get your iron trapdoors, and here comes the little bit of a tricky part. What you're going to do is you're going to make sure that these iron trapdoors on the minecart side face directly this way. This way, if you flip a leather or a lever, the trapdoor will face downwards, like so. Now, you're going to want these to keep these up for now, but do this on both sides so that make sure that both of them can close like the way I showed you. Then go ahead and grab your levers and just place them on the interior of that and then you can flip them on as such. Do the same on the other side. Next, you're going to grab your hoppers and put a hopper from the dispenser to the trap door and do this on both sides so that the symmetry and the whole thing works. Then you're just going to grab your stairs and you're going to decorate the place a little bit more nicely than you would previously just because open gaps don't really fit with this build. Do the same on both sides. Make sure that they're just, you know, make the place look a little bit nicer than you found it. Next, you can finally fill in all these blocks except for the piston bit. So you can fill in this block, this block, this block, this block, 
this block, and this block. If you look up, it might look like a creeper face. Coming around to the back, you just want to fill up this area with some nice touches to the back. You might want to put some stairs here. Whatever your fancy, I would rather put stairs here as well, just to make it look a little bit nicer. Now, if you haven't placed down your lava buckets, I would highly recommend doing so right now. They're gonna be tested just a little bit here and they're just gonna fire once while completely staying still. This means it has worked. So then just grab your eggs and your chickens, whatever the case, you're just gonna grab chickens, eggs, and you're gonna just throw 16 eggs into the hopper. Whoops, I missed here. You're gonna throw 16 eggs in the hopper here and then it starts firing. And then you can grab 16 more chickens or eggs of your fancy. Let's throw more in here. And let's spawn in some chickens in here. You might want to have chickens at the ready as well so they start producing eggs. And as we come to the front here, the chickens are already in the minecarts ready to be killed by the lava when they grow up. So guys, this was a really easy and fun tutorial to make a chicken farm in your 1.17 worlds. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Captain Al here, signing off. Udon.